The nation's schools are facing a massive wave of retirements with almost a quarter million teachers likely to leave the classroom when this, year sco this school year ends. One math teacher, though, in Virginia, Lou Coconus, is not going to be one of those. At 91 years of age, retirement isn't even on his radar. Scott McFarland shows us how his dedication has inspired generations of students. Lou Coconus hits the treadmill most mornings to keep up his endurance and his strength for a career that must feel something like a marathon. Now in his 90s, Kokonis is in his 63rd year teaching math at Alexandria City High School in Northern Virginia. Divide by two. And that adds up to thousands of students. 6,400 students. Some of them are doctors and lawyers. <laughs> He's also had students like Mark Eisenhower become fellow teachers and then beat him to retirement. You retired. Mm -hmm. He's still here. How is that possible? Yeah, I didn't think it was possible. I didn't think it was, I thought he was close to retirement when I was a student here. It's only possible because Kokonis first entered these halls before the Beatles formed. This rock and roll group has taken over. Before space travel. Lift off. Denominator. The calculus Kokonis teaches hasn't changed. How many got this one right? Okay, you all want to look over your tests. But it's his old school approach of offering free tutoring on Saturdays and being the first to arrive each day, which connects with his students. To be working and teaching for this long and to still like put in all this extra effort on Saturdays, I really admire that about him. Does anybody know what the answer is going to be? With no wife or children, Kokonis devotes himself completely to his students. Yeah. If I had a wife, she'd probably be me within a week. And he insists retirement is not one of the three R's he'll consider. My mind is set that I'm going to do well this year and I'm going to enjoy it. And I'm going to try to come next year if they'll take me. Scott McFarland, CBS News, Alexandria, Virginia.